Hello guys, if you have solved Break Your Galaxy Note and you want to restore it to the original firmware, first of all you need to do is switch off your phone, take out your battery and when you are done just put your battery back in and then you need to go to your recovery menu and for doing that you have to hold your volume up, home and power button at the same time until you see the Samsung logo. Here we go. Just leave all of them when you see the Samsung logo. And now you can see that I have entered the recovery menu. Here I have a custom recovery. And even if you have the original recovery, it uh, doesn't matter. Just go to factory wired data wire factory reset. Uh, my custom recovery is touch capable. And if your custom recovery is not touch capable, then you can like navigate through your volume buttons and select your power button then just go to wipe data factory reset and just click yes it will clear your old data in your phone and when it's done just go to wipe cache partition yes and when you are done just power your device off or just take out the battery yeah so if you take out the battery I will just show you yeah just take out the battery and after that plug it back in and then you need to download the files in the description there will be two links one is for Odin and the second one is the, uh, the original stock firmware the second thing you need to do is download the files in the description. There will be two links, one is for Odin and the second one is for this firmware. So when you are done downloading them, extract them into two different folders in your computer and then you have to put your Samsung Galaxy Note into download mode and for doing that you have to hold your volume down, home and power button at the same time until you see the download mode. Here we go and then it will be just written warning custom OS uh, can cause critical problems in phone and install applications just ignore that warning go select volume up and now it will say downloading do not turn off the target then just connect your USB cable to your computer plug it into your device and now you'll see there's a sound in my computer that some uh, device has been recognized when you have connected your phone in the download mode you need to go to Odin and then just right click on the Odin and run as administrator. It will ask for the permission, say yes. And now you'll see as the Odin is opened up and right here my device has been recognized. And if it doesn't recognize your device just download Samsung keys and just install it. It will basically install the Samsung drivers for your phones. So when you are done doing that go to PDA click PDA and um, basically my files are on desktop new folder firmware and here's my MD5 file when you extract the WinRAR file which you get from sammobile.com just select this one click open and for your information guys please don't tick mark anything here otherwise it can seriously cause heartbreak for your phone as you can see now it's selected the file it just takes some time and when you are done just click uh, let me show you guys and then just click start and now you'll see the process is going on in the computer cache files and in the galaxy note 2 as you can see a bar has appeared and just leave it as it is, don't plug out your phone or anything, just leave as it is. I'll just fast forward the video.
yeah guys now you can see as it is done and my phone is restarting I'll just show you yeah and for your information you can just plug out the USB cable there's no need for it now Yeah guys, so as you can see, the phone has restarted, uh, don't worry guys, I fast forward the video, but um, it took me around 3 minutes to start the phone for the first time. So don't panic and think that your phone didn't repair, like it didn't come back to its stock firmware. So that's pretty much it guys, don't forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel. And guys, one more thing, I am new to the YouTube, so don't forget to, you know, like leave suggestions on in the comment section down below. Thanks a lot again, don't forget to like and subscribe, <laughs> thank you, bye.